Hi, I'm Laura Robinson, Technology Specialist with Microsoft Dynamics CRM Online. In today's video, I will demonstrate mail merge within CRM Online. Microsoft Dynamics CRM is tightly integrated with Office products such as Word, Excel, and Outlook. For mail merge, it is available for leads, accounts, contacts, opportunities, quotes, and custom entities. You can access it from default and custom views, campaigns, and quick campaigns. In today's demonstration, I will cover three topics. Creating a mail merge template, creating a quick campaign email using mail merge, and creating mailing labels using mail merge in Word. In the first scenario, I'm going to show how you can create a new mail merge template. In this case, I'm going to create a template for an upcoming services promotion I want to send to all of my contacts. In the Outlook interface or in the web interface, I go to Settings, Templates, Mail Merge Templates, and I click New. This opens up a new screen where I can describe my new template, so I'll type in a title. I can put in a description, and then I have to associate it to an entity. In this case, I'll choose Contact. The next step is to either create a new Word document that you want to uh, use for the mail merge, or go ahead and attach one that you already have. Because I've already created a basic template, I'm going to go ahead and browse and attach that template. It does have to be in XML format, so if you've saved it in Word, go ahead and save the file as XML and attach that. After attaching the document, you can then edit the template in Word or simply save and close the record. If I edit this template in Word, it will take me out to Word, and I have the option of inserting any fields from CRM that I want to include, such as a salutation line. If I make any changes here, I do need to save these locally and re-upload them as a new attachment. If I don't choose to make any changes, I can leave the template as is, and I can make any changes once I go through the actual mail merge when I'm sending this to contacts. To summarize, this is how you create a new mail merge template in CRM and make any changes to it. In the second demonstration, I'll show you how to create a quick campaign email using the mail merge template that we just created. I'll open up a marketing list I've created called Customer Promotion. Within this marketing list, I can manage the members. I can add or remove any members, but for this scenario, I'll leave it as is and go ahead and create the quick campaign. This launches the quick campaign wizard, which walks me through a series of steps. I'll name the campaign. I'll select email via mail merge. and then open up the personal mail template that I created. This is going to open up the mail merge document in Word. And as you can see, it pulls in all the contacts I had in my marketing list. Click OK. And simply walk through the, st the steps for creating your mail merge. I can include any fields that I want to put in from the contact such as a name. And then preview my mail messages and complete the merge. And I will complete it to electronic mail. I put in my subject line. And I can change the mail format if I want to make this an attachment or even just plain text but I'll keep it as HTML so I can preserve my images and click OK. I'd like to create some CRM activity so that I have a history of this in CRM and then I also want to include an unsubscribe link in the email message and click OK. As you can see, it put the unsubscribe link in there and it's cycling through all the contacts that I want to send this email to and sending out the email. And then at the end I get a confirmation that the mail merge messages are tracked. 
If I go to my Outlook sent items, I can then view all of the sent items that I just sent using Mail Merge. And as you can see, it preserved the Word document template that I had created and it also inserted all those contact names. Now that you've seen the capabilities for creating a quick campaign email using Mail Merge, we'll now create some mailing labels in Word using Mail Merge. In this demonstration, I'll create mailing labels using the view My Active Contacts. I could also use a different view I have saved, or create a new view using Advanced Find, or even use a marketing list. But in this case, I'll just use my active contacts. I'll select all my contacts and click the Word icon in the toolbar. This opens up a dialog box where I can select the mail merge type. In this case, I'll make some labels. And either start with a blank document or a template. I'll start with a blank document. And then I want to merge all the selected records on this page. I could further add some data fields if I needed to include any more data in my labels. And click OK. This opens up Word, and again you can see how my contacts are pulled in using the integration with CRM. I click OK. Choose my labels. and then walk through the steps for creating my address labels. I can insert my merge fields. and then update all labels to carry on that uh, the merge fields I created. I'll preview my labels and then complete the merge. I can at this point edit any individual labels or upload the template to CRM if I wanted to save this or go ahead and click print to print out my labels. To summarize this demonstration, we've created a mail merge template, we've created a quick campaign email using that mail merge template, and then we've created some mailing labels in Word using mail merge. I hope you enjoyed the video and please have a great day.